morning musings from the studio. It is Sunday today and a blistery, blustery day. Um, cold, it snowed, not on the island, but uh, in the surrounding mountainous areas here in Haikiviki. And um, I am in the studio this morning uh, feeling quite nice. Loads of happiness, dopamine, serotonin gushing through my body uh, for no particular reason, just uh, enjoying this morning. And part of the reason why I'm enjoying this morning and have tons of gratitude is because I didn't have to get up out of my nice warm bed into a cold house because my uh, partner loved he got up and he lit the wood stove in the kitchen and um, warmed up the house so uh, uh, providing you know providing uh, um, just some beautiful morning comfort and I woke up just very very uh, grateful that I got to wake up into a warm home rather than get up out of a nice warm bed into the cold uh, 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 house and warm it up myself. <laughs> it was nice to have somebody do it for me. So I'm uh, grateful for that, uh, grateful for all the good things that I have um, in this little tiny studio, right? I went down uh, yesterday, not yesterday, on Friday, uh, painting, uh, plein air painting and filming and doing a whole thing. And I've got lots of footage that I have to get through. Good morning, Corby. Good to see you. Have a beautiful, beautiful Sunday. I hope it's sunny and warm and beautiful in your area. Maybe not, but maybe it is. <laughs> uh, so um, I've been painting uh, and working on these film clips and uh, trying to get um, a nice little vlog style video out of me leaving the house and taking you with me on a plein air painting exhibition and going through some of the things that um, that I go through when I go out plein air painting. On this particular day, if you can see up there, uh, I was not <laughs> freezing and yeah, it's, it's uh, cold and stormy here. But cozy inside, that's the important thing. Yeah, it's like like it is here. So um, I, I was doing these little sketches of the, of the seascape, a seascape that I was doing. Uh, and I had the intention of spending the entire day out just outside because it was gorgeous and uh, painting and getting the sunshine and just being out in this beautiful, landscape that I live in and um, but I got uh, uh, a call um, and a meeting that got set up so I had to pack up early but the important thing was that I went out and I have these two little Notan style sketches that I was able to do while I was there and uh, now I'm going to uh, do a sketch today. You can see I've got the thirds uh, uh, mapped out on this board that I'm using and I uh, will do a study of one of the two notans uh, or maybe a mix of the two notans and I have a video of the area so I will have that playing uh, as my reference and with the headphones in so that I'm basically hearing just the sea and the, the wind and everything that was, uh, that was happening that day will just bring me right back as if I were actually there. So the mind is a beautiful thing that way that it can just um, 
uh, recreate and bring you back to uh, experiences that we've already had. Uh, so I'm going to rely on that today. Hopefully I'll be able to get that done by the afternoon. But first, uh, uh, I have uh, tech stuff to do and get um, more of this Kajabi thing going. And I'm, I'm getting that going and work uh, coming forward. So I'm able uh, to, um, to get a course out very quickly. Hopefully by the end of the month it will be ready. So um, those are the things that are going on in the studio today. Uh, just lots of gratitude uh, in, this, um, in this moment and for the people that are with me in my life and for the experiences that I get to have on this tiny little island. And, uh, you know, like I've said other times, some things are not available, but other things are. And I think wherever we are on the planet, we are always able to lift our gaze up a little bit higher into that area of um, appreciation for what we do have in this day, in this moment. And the more you focus on that, the more you focus on that, and the more it is a reality in your life because you are nourishing those higher frequencies, those higher vibrations, those higher emotions, those higher concepts that lead us out into more open spaces within us rather than crunching down and closing up. You know that feeling, right, of, of, of holding back and just tightening up. And the more you are in that space, you can't look up and out and say, ah, look at that sunshine, or look at those beautiful clouds, or anything that is more positive, more uplifting to make your day beautiful and full of gratitude and full of just this deep appreciation that you have a tiny little studio no matter what that little studio is where it is if it's a corner of your kitchen table or if it's uh, in a backpack and you move it here and there or if you have a space your studio is in here right here so when you cultivate that positive feeling, when you cultivate the joy of look what I do have, uh, I don't know you guys, it works for me. It makes my life beautiful every day. And you know, I wasn't always thinking this way. And when I wasn't thinking this way, my life was on this up and down roller coaster, useless, <laughs> um, didn't really get me anywhere. So I much prefer this balanced uh, movement of, you know, just putting the shoulders back and down, opening that heart area and accepting whatever is happening in this day. And even if it's not very good, there's always something good to look at. And that's just been my philosophy. Hopefully it will be something that you can use when you're not having a very good day. But today, I happen to be having a beautiful, beautiful day and full of gratitude, full of appreciation for everything that I do have 
and um, it may be a tiny little island, it may be a tiny little studio, but I've got everything I need. Hoping you're all having a beautiful, beautiful day, and I will see you again tomorrow. Thanks for being here.